Okay, so start a new project. Delete everything and spawn in a cylinder. Set the cylinder to have eight or so sides and press S and Z to scale it down. Select the top face and press S to make it bigger. Then press E to extrude the face as far up as you want. Scale and extrude again. Now keep scaling and extruding to get whatever shape you want. If you want to create an indent or hole in the top, press I to inset and then press E to extrude in this time. Add a material and set it to whatever color you want. I'm going to add another color in the center for this face. So select the faces you want to recolor. Add a new material, set the color to whatever you want, and click assign to get it to those faces. It's pretty simple, just remember S for scale, E for extrude, and I for inset. I'll do the same thing to make a barrel, just extrude and scale. In the top and bottom of this one, I'm going to inset and extrude. I want to make the bands that hold the boards together, so I'm going to make loop cuts with Control r and scroll to get as many as you want evenly spaced apart. Next, I can select the parts I want to bring out and press E to extrude. Scale them out to the size you want. Add a new material and assign it to the selected faces. I also added some loop cuts all around close to the edges and then added in another one between them. I selected the center edges and scaled them in to make a clearer edge to the boards. You can just use S, E, I, and Control-R to make pretty much anything with minimal polygons.